deep breath in and out. I did the hemodialysis where they insert a fistula into your arm. And when you go into the clinic, they put two needles in, one to take blood out and clean it through the dialysis machine, and one that brings the blood back into your body. For the first 11 years, I dialyzed in center uh, three times a week uh, for about five hours at a time. And, and that's conventional dialysis. I've been on dialysis now for uh, be two years and 10 months. What it's doing is uh, taking, taking my, drawing my blood out and running it through the machine. These two, two plastic tubes or lines, that, it's in my arm. I, I think of it as it's like the cooling system on your, on your, uh, in your car. One line takes it to the engine block and the other returns it. And so that's how it is here. The, the blood uh, leaves my body and, and goes through Max, his filter, and then it returns. That's a pretty slick deal. I realize now that this is the only life support that I have. The only life support that I have because I want to live longer. It wouldn't be after going dialysis if you didn't need it. And so in order to stay alive, you need to have dialysis. Yeah, some days I would go to dialysis and go home and take a nap for maybe two hours and then go work uh, for eight hours and then come back home. And so uh, it was hard for me at first, but uh, I believe once I had the mind state that I could do it, then I, I was able to do it. And uh, it never really was an issue for me once I pushed myself to be able to handle that.